We're going out there to that island. It's an island called Gaspari Island in Shagaramas Harbour here in Trinidad. And I happen to know that my scout troop, the 6th Trinidad Sea Scouts, are out there on their Christmas camp at the moment. They don't know I'm coming. I've decided to row out there and join them. So if that sounds like a fun trip to you, then stay tuned. This is where I've come from. Out of the harbour there. And that's where I'm going. Gaspari Island. You can see I've got all my camping gear here with me. Plus some. And a few goodies for the scouts there also. As you can see, it's a bit of a haul. So I better get cracking. That's where I've come from. I'm nearly where I'm supposed to go. There's less of guys in there. One other time. Over there. So this is the site of Christmas camp 2018 for the 6th Trinidad Sea Scouts. You see this kind of, there's dorms there for the youngsters. These guys are mowing the lawn. It's part of being here, doing a bit of yard work. You can see the hammock village over there. Look, hammock and tarp village, that's the seniors. All sorted there. And down that away is the water, is the ocean. What a fantastic spot. What lucky lads we are. I don't really remember he made that trap for us. We got to go all the way up to us, but like, when he came from, just just like, huh? Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's Getting ready for a hike up to the guns. So I'm bringing up the rear here today on the rear guard and uh, we're on our way up to the top of this ridge through the bush here where there are gun emplacements still left from the second world war I don't think they saw any action but they were put there uh, by the US the US army um, because the whole of Shagaramas was a US naval base at one time and the peak up here gives a great field of view to the uh, incoming Alright so this, this, this was one of the two um, batteries put on put on Gaspar Island by the, by the British forces during World War II yeah, yeah, so right. if you all know any, no, some history about Trinidad, it was used in World War II as a, as a British piece, right? So we have one hand and one further down, and they were used to stop the other So one hand Oh, like one and a one guard, so like you know, take out one of those men that don't work. Yeah, you're gonna have a guard, there would be a bunch of people guarding this. Oh, you're gonna have like a specified guard for this. One. <laughs> that is one ugly looking spud right there. 
Let me give him some perspective. There's a shoe. There he goes. Not in my hammock, thank you. Well, the weather outside is frightful. Not really. Let's go for a swim. <laughs> 